Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. R. H. O. and J. Whole cast on Chopping Block. Bravo fans can watch Teresa Gudis on season 2 of House of Villains, but will they ever see her return to R. H. O. and J? A new source spills that Bravo is eyeing a possible reboot of the whole cast. Is everyone from New Jersey on the chopping block? Keep reading for the latest on the behind-the-scenes drama. Is the whole R.H.O.N.J. cast on chopping block? Season 14 of The Real Housewives of New Jersey may be the last viewers see of the franchise. Rumors have swirled for months that the show is getting a total overhaul and even OG Teresa Gudis isn't safe. Bravo's Andy Cohen tried to shut down rumors of a reboot. What's the latest? A new source told the U.S. Sun earlier this month that the future of RHONJ is still up in the air. The network is reportedly unhappy with the major decline in ratings. Bravo is allegedly considering firing the whole season 14 cast and starting over like they did with The Real Housewives of New York. But it isn't just RHONJ that is in danger of big changes. The Insider revealed that the network is keeping a close eye on the ratings for the other Real Housewives shows. They spilled, New Jersey is the main point of discussion right now. The OC cast will most likely be shaken up slightly but not completely rebooted. They're happy overall with the drama those women brought. The source added, no one is safe. Any cast member on any franchise could be on the chopping block at any point and they're not afraid to make the cuts when they need to. Bravo fans debate downfall of The Real Housewives of New Jersey. Season 14 of RHONJ included stars Teresa Gudis, Melissa Gorga, Dolores Catania, Margaret Josephs, Jennifer Aydin, Danielle Cabral, and Rachel Fuda. Jackie Goldschneider and Jennifer Fessler appeared as friends of the housewives. Who is responsible for the decline in ratings? RHONJ fans took to Reddit to debate what caused the downfall of the franchise. One fan blamed long-running RHONJ star Teresa Judas. The Teresa factor was so unsustainable. Her idiocy is fun in small doses. You can't have a main cast member who doesn't understand metaphors, can't compute basic logic and doesn't believe that she needs to expand her thought process at all. But another Bravoholic put the blame on the network and the entire cast. I think the entire cast and Bravo are to blame. The show lacks light-hearted fun and feels intensely orchestrated. The manufactured cliffhangers meant to keep viewers coming back often fall flat. The buzz around The Real Housewives of New Jersey, RHO and J, cast is at an all-time high as rumors circulate about a massive shakeup that could potentially see the entire cast on the chopping block. Fans are no strangers to the show's tumultuous cast dynamics, but the prospect of everyone facing the axe is unprecedented. Is Bravo clearing house to start fresh? Or are these rumors just the latest chapter in RHO and J's ongoing saga of intrigue and drama, setting the stage? The current RHO and J lineup has had its share of highs and lows, delivering plenty of the jaw-dropping moments that fans tune in for, but recent ratings dips and social media backlash suggest that audiences are craving something more. After years of storylines revolving around family feuds, legal battles, and shifting alliances, some fans argue that the cast dynamics are feeling stale. This year has been a particularly turbulent one for the franchise, with Teresa Judas's rumored break from the show sending shockwaves through the fanbase. Teresa is not just a key player but the face of the franchise. From her infamous table flip in season one to her recent feud with her brother Joe Gorga, Teresa has consistently anchored the series. However, her potential exit, coupled with rumors of Bravo executives looking to revamp the entire cast, has left fans wondering if Art H. O. and J will ever be the same again, or if it's headed in a bold new direction. The threat of a clean slate. The idea of replacing the entire cast is a radical one. Real Housewives franchises have been refreshed with new cast members before, but rarely have they all been replaced simultaneously. Some insiders speculate that this sweeping change could be Bravo's attempt to inject new life into RHONJ. By casting fresh faces, producers may hope to reignite the spark that made early seasons of RHONJ must-watch TV. According to anonymous sources close to the production, Bravo executives have been conducting focus groups with longtime fans and new viewers alike. 
The findings reportedly suggest that while fans appreciate the deep-rooted family connections on Arahyo and Jay, many feel that the cast has become predictable, with certain storylines feeling recycled. There is speculation that Bravo wants to take the show in a younger, fresher direction to appeal to a new generation of viewers without alienating the loyal fanbase. While no official statement has been released, some of the cast members have been dropping hints on social media, fueling speculation and furthering the uncertainty. Teresa has been notably quiet, which has only intensified the rumors of her impending departure. Meanwhile, Melissa Gorga, who has been Teresa's sister-in-law and sometimes adversary, posted a cryptic message on Instagram, saying, When one door closes, another opens. Change is scary but exciting. Dolores Catania, a cast member since season 7, seems torn about the possible changes. Known for her calm demeanor amidst the chaos, Dolores has commented publicly about how close she feels to her fellow cast members and how important their friendships are, but she has also hinted at being open to new possibilities, saying in a recent interview, it's show business. We all know things can change overnight. Jennifer Aydin, who has made a name for herself with her outspoken personality and willingness to confront the other housewives, took a more defiant stance. She posted on social media, they can shake it up all they want, but we're still the ones who make this show what it is. Her post was met with mixed reactions, with some fans rallying behind her and others, suggesting that she might be part of the problem. Meanwhile, fans are also speculating about Margaret Josephs, who has been open about her willingness to take on her co-stars and speak her mind. Margaret's unique style and bold personality have garnered her a loyal fan base, but in recent seasons, some viewers have felt she's become too involved in other people's drama. She's yet to make a public statement, but her silence is adding to the sense of uncertainty. Could a full reboot actually work? For any show to remain compelling, it has to evolve with the times. But could RHONJ truly survive an overhaul of this magnitude? RHONJ has built a legacy on family dynamics, deeply personal conflicts, and a level of authenticity that other franchises often lack. The fear is that by replacing the entire cast, the show might lose the very essence that sets it apart. Historically, other franchises have seen mixed results with cast shakeups. When The Real Housewives of New York City attempted a partial reboot, it faced backlash from fans who felt the new cast members lacked the chemistry and history of the original lineup. While some viewers appreciated the fresh faces, many felt the reboot lacked the authenticity and real-life connections that had previously made the series compelling. However, Bravo seems confident that RHONJ could defy those odds, possibly creating a new kind of housewives experience. Some insiders speculate that casting could shift to include younger women or perhaps even bring in individuals with no pre-existing family connections, relying instead on business partnerships or longtime friendships. The potential for entirely new conflicts and alliances could open up a different direction for the show, bringing a fresh energy that both attracts new viewers and keeps longtime fans engaged. As always, the real test will be the viewers. Aragh Oenje's fan base is among the most vocal in the Housewives universe, with fans taking to Twitter, Instagram, and Reddit to express their opinions. Some fans are excited about the possibility of a fresh start, saying that the show could use new faces and dynamics to shake things up. Others are more resistant, feeling that the current cast is irreplaceable and that a full cast overhaul would be a disservice to the fans who have invested in these characters over the years. Fan campaigns to save the OGs have already started popping up, with hashtags like hashtag Keep Teresa and hashtag Arihel and Forever trending on social media. Bravo executives are likely watching these reactions closely, aware that a massive backlash could impact viewership and the overall success of the show. What lies ahead? If the rumors are true, the next season of RHONJ could mark the end of an era. Whether it's a complete cast shake-up or a partial one, changes seem imminent, and Bravo appears ready to take risks to reinvigorate the franchise. The network knows that RHONJ has a dedicated fan base, but it also recognizes the need to adapt to the changing reality TV landscape. For now, all eyes are on the current cast as they await word on their futures. It's a suspenseful time for both the housewives and the fans, as each cast member faces the possibility of leaving a show that has defined their lives for years.
Regardless of what happens next, one thing is certain. The Real Housewives of New Jersey will continue to deliver the drama, whether with familiar faces or entirely new ones. Will Teresa Judas remain the reigning queen of RHONJ, or will a fresh face take her place? Can Bravo successfully pull off a complete reboot, or will the fans rally to keep their beloved cast members in place? Only time will tell, but one thing is for sure. RHONJ's next season will be one for the books.